if you're like me, you don't get outside much, which means you never really know when it's raining. So we're gonna do something complicated and unnecessary to fix that. This build is fairly simple. It only requires a few parts, but I've never done it before. Arduino, USB cord, jumper cables, tinfoil, piezo, piezo? Piezo. Paisano. Breadboard. Guess I better show you the circuit we're actually going to be using. So here we're connecting the red wire to digital pin 11 on the Arduino, which is the little circuit board there, and the black pin to digital ground. So when I tell the Arduino to send a signal out from the 11th pin, it runs through the piezo, which makes it output a tone, and then it returns through the ground. All right, there's our circuit. Let's test it to make sure it works. All right, it works. All right, so to get something to detect rain, we need something to just detect water in general. And I don't know what kind of sensor that is. So let's just search it up right here. I don't have one of those. So if there's any other way to actually detect water, then I need to think of one. So it took me a day, but I figured it out. I kept asking myself, what could I use to detect water? But then I realized, water is conductive. So all I had to do was make a gate that was completed by water. So I put two leads in a Hooper's Crab House cup and then attached a light to test it so when I poured water, which is our stand-in for rain, it would complete the circuit and done. Now, this is also extremely anxiety-inducing, because everyone knows water and electronics don't mix, but it'll be fine, right? Right? All of that looks like this. This is really hard to see, but if you do pay attention, the light does turn on. Here, this next clip, this will show it better. There, there it is. There, you can see. Uh, yeah. Alright, it's been a day and we figured out how to close a gate using water, leads, tin foil, and two Joe's Crab House cups. So, all we need to do is the same thing with the light, but when the gate is closed by pouring water in there, it plays the Song of Storms. Then we leave it outside, it'll fill up with water, and then it'll play the Song of Storms when it's raining. Perfect plan. All right, everything's wired up. If we upload this here, now we pour in our fake rain, because I'm not waiting for an actual storm to come along, but you know, you get the point, it's still water.
It worked. We did it. I don't want to touch it. Here, have my pour this in without screwing it up. Well, that's one way, but if we get rid of our conductor, well, let's example once again. Alright, this was dumb. I hope you enjoyed watching it. Um, follow me on Twitch if you also want to do that. That would be cool. Tell me if you want to see more stupid stuff. Thanks for watching.